Hello boys and girls, and welcome back to a new video. Many of you have contacted me through Instagram and Facebook asking me a very common question. Can you remove the scratches from the PPF wrap without damaging it or, as we say, burning it? In this video, we will show you in detail which procedure to use in order to achieve this effect without actually causing any damage. So stay tuned. On today's example here, you can see that we have a wrap on the B pillar of the car. In the previous video, I've shown you how to polish the B pillar with paint on it. But in this case, the wrap on this vehicle has been applied post purchase. When you open the door, you can actually see that this is a wrap that was put on after the purchase of the vehicle. For the B pillar in this case, we will use the Flex Circular Polisher. as well as a pad that is of medium strength. Do not use any harsh pads or wool or microfiber because the wrap is generally polished in a different way compared to the paint job. Combined with this pad, we will use a rough paste, in this case by Zwizzer, heavy cut. However, make sure that your paste is water-based. A small amount of paste is enough for this procedure and of course make sure to have a control lamp so you can see what's happening with the surface. It is important to make sure that you handle smaller sections of the B pillar. Do not try to polish the entire B pillar at once because to remove these scratches you have to properly heat up the wrap. If we have a high quality wrap, the way to remove these scratches is to heat up the wrap properly. Apply medium pressure during the polishing process, too strong or too lightly, and make sure the movements are very small and slow. Once you've heated up the wrap, then reduce the speed to one on your circular polisher and continue the process. With this, we are allowing the wrap to cool down slowly, and while this is happening, the scratches will slowly disappear from the wrap. Wait for a little bit after you finish the first layer of polishing, and then wipe off the paste using the microfiber cloth very lightly. Do not apply the pressure. Once you wiped it off, then you can continue polishing the next segment of the B-pillar. Now, as you can see here, after removing the hard cut paste, this is what you get. All the scratches that could have been removed are now removed. However, for the rest of the process, we will use another paste, also a water-based paste. We will be using the Zwizzers UC1000, the ultra-fine cut paste. It's also specific because it's a good swirl remover and it has ceramic sealing properties. For this process, we will use the same pad and only four drops on it. So now, let's see the result that we got from polishing this wrap. As you can see here, the wrap has tightened up a little bit due to the heating up and cooling down during the polishing process. And the result is as you see it right here. As you can see, there are no scratches or swirl marks. The shine is exquisite. 
and the ceramic coating contained in the second paste will give you a long-term shine and protection in periods of more months. I hope this video helped you and this process gave you a good insight on how to perform this job. At the end of this video, you will see that using a rag will not be able to damage the wrap anymore. So thank you for tuning in, boys and girls. Please share, like, and subscribe. If you have any comments or questions, make sure to leave them in the comment section and I'll get back to you. Until next time, stay safe, take care of yourselves, and goodbye.